Eleanor, thank you. One year ago, a Lexington artist lost irreplaceable work when his house caught fire. Today, he says he can't thank the community enough for their support that helped him through such a tough time. LEX 18's Catherine Collins has this story. One year after a fire destroyed much of Kipto Tarus's portfolio, he's doing what he loves, making art. This is what his home, which was also his studio, looked like just after the fire. Tarus says he lost irreplaceable items, but even then he was shocked by the outpouring of support. It's an overwhelming thing, you know, once you see that, you know, there's so much love within and around you. Today he's in a new studio. He says he's incredibly grateful for his friends who've helped him along the way. What a way to, you know, to pick up somebody uh, at, at its worst, you know. Now he says he feels it's his responsibility to keep creating, to honor the support he's received. And that's exactly what he's doing. This sculpture in progress will soon be completed outside of the Ashland Henry Clay estate. You have to keep on go doing what you're doing, you know. You have to keep on art making. Some pieces that were burned in the fire, Tarus still has them, but he doesn't see them as damaged. The ones that remained, you know, I'm still like happy about those and cherish them anyway you know, because they, they're the survivors. Now he says he knows things can be here one day and gone the next. So he's taking things day by day. Covering the news in Lexington, Catherine Collins, LEX 18 News. Tarus also has art shows planned for next year in February and in March.